Okay, we're staining our beams. We worked all day yesterday from daylight till dark. And we stained how many deer? 29. 29, and we've got, I think, 32 in this stack to stain all four sides. It's kind of slow going. Once you get down real low, that's when your back starts hurting. Feel like you've been hoeing a garden all day. So, these four by eight beams, 18 foot long. I've got a little reserve for Monday, God willing, and it don't rain. We're gonna get some help in here and we're gonna put those beams up. Those are my, those are my tongue and groove boards that'll go on top of the beams. Here's the ones that we stained yesterday. We laid them all out like this so they can dry good. And if it looks like rain, we'll cover them up. But, and they probably shouldn't lay too long in the sun. It might kind of lighten them up, but we don't really have a choice. And hopefully, as I said, Monday, today's Friday, but hopefully Monday, when all my help shows up, we'll be putting them up. Get a roof on this place and dry it in. There's about a third of my beam brackets. All nice and flat black, got them painted. You have to kind of brush them up with a wire brush and rough them up a little bit first and prime them. And then that has to dry. And then I paint them and they're nice and flat black. And see all those holes in them? Well, I counted them to see how many bolts I would need. 3,003. Now why it came up such an odd number, I don't know. But anyways, 3,003 holes. So I ordered, the only way I could get them in bulk was 3,500 lag bolts, 3 8 by 2 inches, and, and flat washers. Now the flat washers, I was easy to get in black oxide, so they won't need to be painted. But the bolts are not. They're just zinc plated. So I'll put them in, and I guess then I'll go back and spray paint them. So, uh, or touch them up with a brush or something, I don't know, but there's 3,000 of them. So that'll be a fun job, probably off of a real high ladder or maybe a scaffold, because they're going up all over the whole house. This section of the house will have a 12-12 pitch. That section of the house can have a 4-12 pitch. And then eventually there'll be a wraparound porch all the way around and a carport on that end. We're working on it, we're getting closer. So that's all for now. God bless you.